Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I had my final round interview with BCG about two weeks ago and therefore I just want to share with you my experience while my memory is still fresh. So today I'm going to talk about three parts. The first part is what the day was like, the second is what my takeaways are and the third part is what my recommendations to you guys. So let's first start with what the day was like because of the general pandemic situation that we're currently in and therefore I had all of my interviews online through video calls. On the day I had three 45 minutes interviews. On the day the interview started with a brief introduction of the interviewer, a few questions about my past experience, the case study, and finally we had a couple of minutes to discuss whether I had any questions for the interviewer. So all the interviewers were extremely friendly and down to earth. I found the 45 minutes interviews just flew by. The cases were all based on real cases, which just shows the level of considerations and problem solving skills required on a day to day job. At the end of the day, I was fully exhausted. But I just think the overall experience is really worthwhile and really beneficial for me as a person. So after going through the final interview, I have five recommendations for someone who will be going through a similar process like I did. The first recommendation is ask as many questions to your recruiter as possible. So make sure that you know exactly what's going to happen on the day, you know exactly what the format of the interview is and whether there will be extra tests on the day. And my recruiter also paired me with a buddy consultant at BCG who also shared lots of useful tips with me. So I think it's really important for you just to ask as many questions to the recruiter as possible and just to make sure that you are not surprised on the day. And the second recommendation is actually a tip given by my buddy consultant. So in the previous round of interview, I found myself a little bit slow with structuring and therefore she recommended me just go through the news every day, pick up a business case and come up with a structure for the business case. So I did three structuring practice each day and within one week it really helped me to improve my structures and also to make the whole process much faster. The third recommendation is from the previous interviews you would have had some feedbacks from the interviewer. And in that case, make sure that you take notes when you hear about those feedbacks and really absorb it and try to improve it um, until your next round of interview. So this just shows how quickly that you can improve based on the feedback you get. And the fourth tip is use the final questions wisely. Because I was given the name of the interviewers beforehand, so I had the chance to really uh, do some research, understand the sectors that they specialize in, understand the past experience, and just think about what are the potential questions that I can ask them. Number five is, I don't know if this actually made a difference, but I always follow up at the end of the day day after my interviews. At the end of the day, I will just send one email to each of my interviewer to thank their time spent in my interview, explain what I have learned, explain what I enjoy the most, and maybe state at the end that I'm looking forward to getting some feedbacks from them. So in that way, I'm not trying to sell myself or pushing them to make a decision. But at the same time, I want to show them I am polite and I appreciate this opportunity. So this is my experience from my final round interview with BCG. If you find this helpful, give me a thumb up and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.